All we care about right now is that we get that baby back. Right now, the desperate search to find a missing newborn baby stretching into the night and now this morning. This is little one week old Andrew Caballero, an Amber Alert after a grisly triple murder in Miami, leading investigators to Pasco County. So, Pasco deputies and some volunteers are searching the area after Andrew's father, the man thought to have taken him, was found dead. Eight on your sides, Justin Checker is live in Blanton. So, Justin, what is the latest at this point? David and Gail, good morning. Overnight, Pasco County deputies say they are following up on any leads that could bring them closer to little Andrew Caballero, but this morning, still no sign of that missing little boy. Now, down this road here in Pasco County, deputies say they found a man matching the description of the boy's father, Ernesto Caballero, dead from a self-inflicted gunshot near his abandoned van. On your screen right now, take another good look at a picture of baby Andrew Caballero. In a news conference, the sheriff said they did not find a car seat in the white van, but they did recover a key piece of evidence, a pacifier. The Pasco sheriff said they did forensic tests on that pacifier. In addition to deputies searching by foot and on horses, canines were brought in to sniff out clues. Volunteers from the area on ATVs also joined the search for this missing baby boy. This really remains a statewide search with the Amber Alert still active. The sheriff says they are following up on one lead that someone reported seeing a blonde woman in that van. And I sit here and pray to God that that is true and that she has the baby. And if that woman is out there, if there's anybody, if that is a true fact and that woman is out there, please come forward. The deputies are asking anyone who may have seen this white van in the last 48 hours to give them a call. They're trying to determine the route it took from South Florida to northern Pasco County. The sheriff says it may have arrived here in Pasco County as early as Tuesday afternoon. And ahead at 6.30 here on News Channel 8, you'll hear from uh, the wife of someone who is joining in that search on ATVs trying to find this missing baby boy. Now, if you have any information to help find little Andrew Caballero, please give law enforcement a call right away. Back to you. Wow, one week old. I mean, that is such a vulnerable and fragile state. I hope somebody does have the baby and knows how to take care of him. All right, thank you, Justin Shecker, live in Pasco County. All right, let's give you another look at little baby Andrew Caballero. An Amber Alert is in place statewide in hopes of finding this child. Again, if you think you've seen this baby or anyone who may have him, please call 911. Eight on your side is dedicated to following this story for you. To stay on top of all of the developments, be sure to download our WFLA app. We will send updates on the case just as soon as we get them.